All right, welcome back, guys. Now that I've charged the batteries on the camera, things seem to be working a little bit better here. Um, well, telephoto. Like I said yesterday, or last video, um, one of the major problems that we have to deal with is the peened over part here, all the way here, extracting the screw, making sure the area is clean, the threads are good, and also, you can see it down here. Oop, by the way, the little trigger stop pin is gummed up, stuck in position, and I'm unable to adjust it. So I've been soaking it with oil, but it hasn't been done, you know, it hasn't moved at all. So I'm probably gonna have to force it. I hope it doesn't strip out and I gotta um, drill it out. It's just going to be a bad thing all around. Um, and at that point here, this is split. And inside here, which I'll show later when I'm taking it off, is there's a ring on that part. If you can see it here. It's supposed to look like that. And, but on this one here, this portion is rounded over. So we're getting a lot of springy, oops, sorry, a lot of springy action. Still seems to work okay though. I'll probably take a better look at it. Maybe it can be cleaned up and resold. Uh, but I just wanted to say, as I said before with the broken stock, one of the easiest things to do to replace that is just get a new one, which is what I did here, as you see in the last video. This is a nice stock from Numeric Gun Parts Corp. Um, they're about $80, I think it says Winchester there, Winchester Repeating Arms, yep. Kind of fun, kind of cool. That's the easiest part, you can buy all kinds of them, they go up to $350 if not more, um, from that point there. So what I'm going to do now is, one of the things I definitely have to do is we have to grind this off without damaging the, the receiver as much as possible. And then replacing the pin is pretty much easy. But once I get that out, I gotta replace the sear. And that is the number one project that I gotta go on here. So we're gonna end this for now. And I am going to grind that off, see if I can get a tripod so it's not so shaky. And we'll get the sear out and check that out and probably replace that with a new sear that I have. All right, talk to you guys later. Bye.